Hey, good morning. It's Mike again. Uh, don't think I abandoned you. It's uh, it's just that we can't we can't go through developing the framework for a family component and move on to chapter 16 without me stressing that chapter 15 is very important. Um, it's just very important developing the framework for a family component and understanding um, adaptive components and uh, the family editor that interface. Uh, it's going to be really important if you're in the business of creating parts uh, or reutilizing parts within your project and within your models, uh, you're going to need to uh, really dig into that uh, for, for speed purposes. You don't want to be drawing the same thing over and over again. Um, you don't want to be copying the same thing over and over again, copying and rotating and all those things. So. Uh, without over constraining the model or the, the family that you're creating, without over constraining it with unnecessary reference lines, planes, and dimensions, and options, arrays, you're still going to need to uh, exhibit some form of parametric constraint to it. All right, so I don't want to rush right into stairs and railings. Even though I'm really eager, I'll be honest with you, I'm really eager to get into the MEP because there's just so much room for growth in, um, in that sector, um, as well as the architectural engineering sector. I'm not going to deviate too far from the blue and white collar. As much as life tends to push you back and forth, um, you got to focus on your strengths. So I know I'm going off on a little bit of a tangent this morning, but I, I, I didn't really feel like we spent nearly enough time on any of that. And it's very important in any event. We are going to get there. Um, we got a, a bunch more. Uh, and annotation is going to play a big part of this. So um, I just wanted to stop there and just say, okay, well, listen, we've been through a lot. Chapter, we made it to page 700 almost, 700 pages. And with all those chapters, there are so many things that we brushed on that we're going to need to keep brushing up on. And the only way to do that is to just remain in the industry, you know, just remain in the industry. So um, what else can I add um, to illustrate my point why I'm making this uh, empty video? Well, life comes at you pretty fast, right? Life comes at you pretty fast. There's not enough time in the day, so we're always thinking of ways to save ourselves time. Time is money. 